Hi, welcome to challenge number nine. In this video, we're going to be looking at the revision history inside of a Google document. So again, what we need to do is open up our Google challenge folder, and today we're going to be working with our Chromebook document. So we'll double click on it to open it up. There's two ways that we can check out the revision histories inside of a Google document. The first way and the longer way would be to click on file and then see revision history. But a more simpler way to do this would be to click on the option at the top of the screen when it tells when the last edit was made. Whenever you click there, it opens up the revision history. We can choose uh, show more detailed revisions down at the bottom and it's going to bring up a list of exactly when every edit was made in the document and it's going to show who it was made by. So we can see that today at 10.48 a.m. there were a couple revisions that have been made. Uh, the pink is done by Samantha and somewhere closer to the bottom there's another one that has been done by me. But for the challenge number nine, what we need to do is we need to find out exactly when the timestamp, so the date and time when you started creating this document, and we need to put that timestamp up at the very top of this document. So to do that, in your revision history, if you scroll all the way down to the very bottom, the very last or first edit or revision history is going to be when you started creating the document. So if we just click on that to double check, we can see that there's nothing in the document. So we're previewing this revision. There's nothing in the document except for that first sentence. Maybe what we'll do is we'll revert back to the original version or the most current version by just clicking up at the very top. And we're going to close down the revision history and we're going to type in our timestamp of when we started it. So down at the bottom, we, na we made note that we started the document on January 21st at 2.52 p.m.